Good afternoon, visitors. Currently arriving through the Duluth Ship Canal, we have the Mishapakot. The Mishapakotten was built as the Elton Hoyt II in 1952 by the Bethlehem Shipbuilding and Dry Dock Company of Sparrows Point, Maryland. She measures 698 feet in length, 70 feet in width, and 37 feet in depth. She's powered by an 8,200 horsepower, six-cylinder Mack diesel engine, which gives her a top speed of 14 knots, or about 16 miles per hour. She's also equipped with bow and stern thrusters to aid her maneuverability in port. The Mishapakotten has 20 hatches on her deck, which open into five cargo holds located below deck. Each hatch covering measures 35 by 11 feet. She has a maximum carrying capacity of 22,300 tons. Above her deck is a 250-foot self-unloading boom, which allows her to unload her own cargo at a rate of 6,000 tons per hour without the aid of shoreside equipment. The Mishapakotten is currently owned and operated by Lower Lakes Towing of Port Tover, Ontario, Canada, a subsidiary of Brand Logistics Incorporated of Jersey City, New Jersey. The Mishapakotten is arriving into the Twin Ports today to take on a load of iron ore pellets at the Canadian National Docks in West Duluth. She'll probably be bringing those back to uh, Algoma Steel in Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan, or Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario. If you see any crew members on deck, make sure to give them a big old wave and welcome them back to the Twin Ports. <laughs> here at the canal. Once again, uh, we have the Mishapakotten arriving through the Duluth Ship Canal to take on a load of iron ore pellets at Canadian National. If you see any crew members on deck, give them a big old wave and welcome them back to the Twin Ports.